Holy smoker, that VCT classic, everybody. I can lift computer now like tens. Baba Bowie. Jet West. What is up, gangsters and YouTube pranksters? Jet West, five foot six, iron, homeless man here. And today we're talking about the classic skin. Oh, and literally 100% of you are subscribed, so be sure to subscribe. You no, know, no. BCT capsules released today, and there's a lot of skins and a lot of player cards. First up, we got the Sentinels classic and player card. Very cool. Red Dead Redemption 2 style colorway. I like it. It's very clean, very decent. Low key kind of looks like that one cheap classic skin, but, uh, you know, I digress. Next up, we got the Zeta, which is the green dream variant. Very cool. I kind of like this colorway a little more. It's like yellow and green. Very nice. Next up, we got the T1 Tyler 1 skin, which, uh, you know, it's it's all right. That's basically the Sentinel skin, but a hell of a lot more ghetto. So yeah. Uh, next up, we got Team Secret. And honestly, there's no secret that their team is shit. But this looks kind of like the uh, Glitch Pop, the gold Glitch Pop, which is cool. Not only is Team Liquid European, they also signed Average Jonas. So this skin's probably D tier. Garbage skin, very ugly. So this abomination is from a team called Talon Esports. And I'm not gonna lie, if you name your whole organization after a League of Legends champion, you can't be expecting me to like your skin. But uh, yeah, it's decent. Literally looks like copy paste at Sentinels, but, you know, whatever. Bonjour, je m'appelle Jet West, Team Vitality, uh, muy bien, muy bien, très bien. At least you guys are French, not French-Canadian, so you get a pass in my books. Very nice yellow colorway, Navi style. And I like the little gun buddy charm on the side. It suits it really well, and this colorway is impeccable. I'm a PRX Glazer. Navi's very cool. It sort of looks like the Vitality one, but slightly better. You know, Navi's always been a great team. Nevertheless, uh, yeah, decent skin, yellow colorway, classic Navi colors. I don't know why Team Heretics got Omen as their logo, and, uh, Quite frankly, they just copy-pasted that, but, uh, you know, I digress. The skin's all right. This one's kind of mid, in my opinion. RRQ, they sort of just ripped off the Dude Perfect logo, but the skin's very nice. We don't have the orange skins in Valorant, and this is quite cool. It got the Halloween vibes to it. Energy going for that white skin supremacy. Very sus pick, but, uh, yeah, it looks very sleek, very clean. I sort of like this colorway for no particular reason. Riot Games really did MIBR dirty. You know, we got the Ukraine colors on the skin, and then do doesn't even match the player card. It should be glowing blue, not red. A sort of fucks with this one. M8, they got a unique colorway and their skin actually matches their player card. So that's very nice. I like the green. I'm a, I'm a green glazer. So yeah, this skin's very nice. Purple and green do go well together. I'm never coming to Brazil, but this one's my favorite. I think this goes absolutely ridiculous, and the player card's sick. We got fucking Yasuo from League of Legends player card. What the hell is this? But uh, Leviathan looking very good. You know, you gotta pronounce it Leviathan, not Leviathan. <laughs> I ain't fucking with crew. You little dumbass bitch, I ain't fucking with crew. <laughs> Well, you gotta call your team Koi, but have a dragon instead of a fish as your logo. That's just stupid. What a missed opportunity. Look at that, this skin, the purple and white, the low-key underrated colorway. I like it. I've never met a gen fan in my life, and the only pussy they get is their player card. I'm pretty sure that's a cat, so, you know, it counts. KC, I'm pretty sure this is the French team that has a lot of fans, and, uh, you know, bonjour, my friends. Bonjour, mon ami. Uh, very nice, very nice. Decent colorway, cool skin, good player card. If you're a fan of GX, you've probably never had sex. Imagine naming your team after a browser, Opera GX. Yeah, this sucks. I I'm not a fan of this team, but the player card goes hard as hell. Literally me carrying the dying Valorant community on my shoulders. I remember when the G2 CEO was hanging around with Andrew Tate and then he got fired from his own org. Like, how are you gonna let yourself get kicked from your own team? team, bro. The team name like Global Esports, you'd expect me to actually know about them, but uh, I think they're doing a pretty bad job at going global if I've never ever heard of them. Ain't no way Furia just took the NRG skin and changed the logo. That's literally all they did. They just put their logo. <laughs> what the hell? Evil geniuses were truly evil when they couldn't afford to pay their players and had to disband their roster. Yeah, I was kind of disappointed, but uh, nevertheless, a decent colorway combo, but I'm pretty sure they lost all their fans, so nobody's gonna be buying this. Their literal logo is telling you to go fuck yourself. Yeah, fuck you. That's right. A lot of these skins are very copy-paste. This looks like the Sentinels, 100 Thieves, T1, all merged together. The red Halloween is coming. We got the pumpkin variant with a Fnatic skin. And, uh, you know, all right, that's decent. We've seen it before, but it's pretty cool. Probably the ugliest skin I've seen yet. The gray and blue is, ugh, it's disgusting. And the player card doesn't even really match their, like, logo, but cool. Cloud 9th, a classic team, always on the bottom of the leaderboards. But uh, nevertheless, cool. It got the cloud vibe to it. Very nice. I've never heard of this team in my life. So call me a hater all you want, but I'm pretty sure if I haven't heard of them, they're not that good. <laughs> does give me huge T1 vibes, but all in all, the skin's very nice. And because it's bleed, you know, the skin's red, which, uh, this is the most loser player card I think I've seen of all time. Plus RR, some, like, fat virgin gaming. Ugh. BBL coming in. You know, we got the Brazilian butt lift gaming. Very cool. And the player card, hardest of all. This player card is killer. And then they added these two player cards randomly just for, like, the whole event. Let's go! Cause I'm feeling like I'm running and I'm feeling like I gotta get away, get away, get away, but I know that I